What's up guys, it's Dallas here and today we are going to be doing our Juice World Pixar tutorial. Uh, in this video we are going to be continuing work on the right side because like in the past videos I said that we'd try, uh, go ahead and, and get the main part complete before we do the background. Alright, so the first thing that we're going to start off with is we are going to grab us iron ore, redstone ore, and polished and a site. We're going to take our iron ore and place it upright diagonal from the redstone ore, then place us two polished and a site to right of it. On the second polished and a site, we're going to place one up, and then we're going to place us redstone ore. Next thing that we're going to do is we're going to take us our gray terracotta here, and we're going to place it on top of the and a site, and we're gonna, then we're going to place us black concrete on top of it, and then and a site. I mean, uh, gray terracotta on top of it. So we went, hopefully I said gray terracotta first time. Sorry if I messed up words. I got a headache right now, so it's kind of distracting me. So we went gray terracotta, black concrete, gray terracotta. Next thing we do is take our black terracotta, and we're gonna go three on top of the iron ore. So we're gonna go one, two, three. And then we're gonna go and take us our brown terracotta right here, place one on top of the soul sand, and then two black concrete on top of the brown terracotta so we're gonna go one two next thing that we're gonna do from there is we're gonna grab us our polished andesite and we're gonna place one to left of the brown terracotta and we're gonna place us resident ore to left of the polished andesite and then place iron ore on top of it and then place two redstone ore on top of the iron ore so one two Alright, so um, I'm trying to decide what the best thing to do. If we do this part, it's going to take a minute to try to get all this stuff filled in, but it's going to be best to go and do it that way. So we're going to go ahead and place stuff to the left. We're going to grab us white terracotta uh, and quartz ore, um, nether quartz ore. So we're going to place this white terracotta to the left of the red sun ore, then nether quartz ore, then white terracotta again. I'm going to place us black, I mean not black, but brown terracotta to left of the white terracotta and then we're going to place black terracotta on top. Uh, we're going to take, go back over to another court ore and we're going to place us two black terracotta on top of it. One, two. We're going to grab us light gray concrete powder and we're going to place us light gray concrete powder then polished andesite on top. And then we're going to place us light gray concrete powder on top of the polished andesite. Next thing we're going to do is take us our white terracotta and on top of the right soul sand right here and place us two white terracotta up. So we're going to go one, two. Then we're going to take us a note block and place it on top of the left note on top of left soul sand. Next thing we do from there is take us granite and we're going to take us our granite and place it to the left of the note block. Then we're going to take us pink concrete powder and place it to the left of the granite. From there what we're going to do is we're going to grab us bone block and we're going to place us two bone blocks to the left of the pink concrete powder and uh, hopefully I said concrete powder I'm sorry if I said concrete and then on the right bone block we're going to place one up. We're going to go back over here to our right and we're going to place a bone block right here in between the black terracotta and then we are going to place actually we're gonna hold on to the bone block so just keep it in your hot bar for right now because we're gonna need it later on. We're gonna take our netherrack and place it to the left to the left of the bone block and then place those white terracotta and place it to the left of the netherrack. Next thing that we are going to do from there is we're gonna take us our granite here and place it to the left of the white terracotta and then we're gonna take us light gray terracotta right here and place it on top of the granite. We're going to take us netherrack and place it to, two to the right of the soul sand right here. So we're going to go one, two. And then from there, what we're going to do is we're going to take us our bone block again. We're going to place it on top of the white terracotta right here. We're going to take purple terracotta and we're going to place it to the right of the bone block. One. And then we are going to go into our inventory and grab us white wool and place it to the right of the purple terracotta. So hopefully I said it was light gray terracotta, bone block, then purple terracotta, then white wool. On top of the white wool, we're going to place us a purpler pillar. 
and we're gonna hold on to that. Next thing we're gonna do is grab us a quartz block. So we got one right here, and we're gonna place it on top of the pink concrete powder right here. And then we're gonna go back over here to our right and place it on top of the redstone ore. We're gonna grab our purple terracotta again, place it to the left of the quartz block that we had just placed and place this two bone blocks on top of the quartz block and the purple terracotta. Next thing we're gonna do from there is we're gonna grab us chiseled quartz and we're gonna take chiseled quartz and we're gonna place it to the left of the black terracotta. Next thing we're gonna do from there is we're gonna take us our black terracotta and we're gonna go one to the left of the chiseled quartz, one on top of it, and then one to on top of the chiseled quartz. From there, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take us our redstone ore and we're gonna place one redstone ore to the left of the light gray concrete powder, and then we are going to take us the redstone ore and place one on top of the granite right there. And we're gonna take our black glazed terracotta again and place one on top of the note block. Next thing we're gonna do from there is take us our purple pillar and place one on top of the court quartz block, and then take us a purpler block here and place the purpler block on top of the black glazed terracotta. Next thing we're going to do from there is we're going to take our purple terracotta again, we're going to place it in between the purpler block and purpler pillar, and then the purpler pillars. Place one on top of the purpler pillar to the far left. And then we're going to grab us soul sand, place it in between the purple, uh, place it in between the purple terracotta, and then place a purple terracotta on top. We're going to place us another brick block to the right of the soul sand, and then we're going to grab us black glazed terracotta, place it to the right of the nether block, the nether brick. My bad. And then we're going to take us nether brick again, place, or er, uh, we're going to take us black terracotta, place it to to the right of the black glazed terracotta and then we're going to place us nether brick to the right of black, uh, black terracotta and then place us black terracotta again to the right. Alright so the next thing that we are going to do is we are going to take our soul sand and we're going to take on top of the black terracotta to the right of the black glazed terracotta we're going to place us two soul sand on top so we're going to go one two then we're gonna take us our um, granite and we're gonna place us granite to right of the soul sand and we'll go one and then we're gonna take us brown terracotta to place the right of the granite. From there what we're gonna do is we're gonna take us nether core ore and on top of the left black glaze terracotta we're gonna place us nether core ore and then we're going to place us a note block, to one to the right of the, of the nether quartz ore, and then one on top of it. Then we're going to place us to the left of the note block, soul sand, and then another note block to the left of the soul sand. We're going to take us light gray concrete powder, and then iron ore. We're going to place us light gray concrete powder to, uh, let's see, on top of the black glazed or the black terracotta to the left here and then place us two iron ore to the right of it so we're gonna go one two we're gonna take us the um nether quartz ore and place it on top of the black glazed terracotta and then we're gonna take us uh we're gonna go down over here and grab us magenta terracotta and we're gonna place it one to the right of the purple terracotta and then one on top of the purple terracotta and then we're going to place us another quartz right in between uh, another quartz ore right in between and then we're going to grab us purple terracotta oops alright and we're going to go purple terracotta on top of the light gray concrete powder magenta terracotta on top of the note block and then two purple terracotta on top of the soul sand. One, two. 
All right, we're gonna continue to work on the right side a bit more now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here. We're gonna grab us another brick, and we are gonna go from the redstone. We're gonna go two to the right with another brick, one two, and then one up on the right block. We're gonna go over here to the redstone. We're gonna grab us some soul sand. We're gonna place a soul sand on top of the redstone, and then we're gonna go four on top of the soul sand. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four. We're gonna go on top of the gray terracotta right here and place us another brick. And then we're gonna take us bedrock from down here, and we're gonna place us two bedrock to right of the another brick right here. So we're gonna go one, two, then two soul sand on top. One, two, and then from there we're gonna take us our nether brick again, and we're gonna go one on top, and then we're gonna go over two to the left. One, two, then we go on top of that one. We're gonna go two, oh, uh, one. Actually, we're gonna go up three. So we're gonna go from right here. We're gonna go three. One, two, three. Then we're gonna go right in between one. So it ends up looking like this. So the next thing that we are going to do from there is we are going to take us our um, we're going to take our arcano wood logs. So we're just going to come down to here, grab oops, grab our arcano wood logs, and we're going to place uh, two to the right of the soul sand. So we're going to get one, two like this, and then we're going to place us soul sand on to the left of the top arcana wood plank next thing we're going to do from there is we're going to take us black concrete place to the left of the nether brick right here and then we're going to take us our black terracotta place it on top of the redstone and the granite and then place us another brick right in between we're going to take us our gravel from right down to here i'm going to grab this and we're going to place it right underneath the soul sand. Oh no. This, I did not mean to drop that. I hate when that's, that happens. It, doesn't happen as, it hasn't happened as much on here as it had over there. Because it was mainly stuff that falls that we used to build over there. So yeah. It's not as bad. Okay, so we're going to take our purple terracotta here and we're going to place it to the left of the gravel. And then we're going to place us redstone ore to the left of the purple terracotta. We're going to take us polished andesite placed to the left of the redstone ore. And then we're going to place us two purple blocks. So one on top of the note blocks or right in between note blocks right there. And then one to the right of it or on top of the soul sand. Then we're going to take us another uh, brick box and we're going to take it one on top of the right purple block and one on top of the andesite block or the polished andesite. Next thing we're going to do is place a soul sand on top of the left nether brick block and then place us black glazed terracotta on top of it and then one to the right of it. Then we're going to take our purple terracotta again. And place it in between the black glazed terracotta and another brick block. Take our, um, we want to grab us magenta terracotta, place to left of the soul sand, and then we're gonna grab us blue terracotta to place underneath it, like this. Then the next thing we're going to do from there is we're going to place us brown terracotta to the left of the blue terracotta like this and then we're going to place us two white terracotta on top. So we're going to go one, two, and then we're going to place us light gray concrete powder to the right of it like this. Alright, we're going to grab us our gray concrete. And we're going to place it one on top of the redstone over here, back over to the right. And then we're going to place our gray terracotta. We're going to go 
two on top of the concrete, one, two, and then two on top of purple terracotta, one, two, and then we're going to take our gray concrete, and then on top of the gray terracotta, we're going to place two on top of the right one, one, two, and then place right here on top of the gray terracotta, another brick block, one, and then gray terracotta to the left of it, and then gray terracotta, one on top of the gray concrete. Alright, so the next thing we are going to do is we're going to go back over here to our right. On top of the gray concrete, we're going to place this gray terracotta, and then one more to the right of it. Then we're going to place this soul sand, and then gray terracotta again to the right. Next thing we're going to do is we are going to take us our black glazed terracotta, an upright diagonal from the soul sand, we're going to place us our black glazed terracotta and then place this nether brick on top. Then we're going to take us blue terracotta from down here and which I could have grabbed it from there. I don't know why I went lower. We're going to place us blue terracotta to the right of the black glazed terracotta and then two on top of the soul sand. So we go one, two. Then we're going to take us our gray terracotta and place two up from the left of the blue terracotta, one and two, and then one on top of another brick block, one. Then right here in between this little gap, we're going to place us brown terracotta. So grab us brown ter oops, that's granite, brown terracotta right here and we'll place it right in between another brick and, and the gray terracotta. Then on top right here in between nether bricks we're going to place us black terracotta and then place us nether brick to the right and then place us black terracotta again then we're going to place us brown terracotta on top of the black terracotta and then brown terracotta to the right of the nether brick next thing we're going to do is in on the soul uh, we're going to place soul sand on top of the nether brick and then place us gray concrete on top of the nether brick right here up left diagonal from the black terracotta and then we're going to place us blue terracotta up left diagonal from the gray concrete then we're going to place us gray terracotta on top of the blue terracotta and we're going to take our nether brick and to on top of black terracotta right here we're going to go up four one two three four then on top of the gray terracotta, we're gonna go up three. One, two, three. All right, and we're gonna go back over here to our right and continue to work on the rest over here so we can have it built up even. And we'll be working away. I think the best thing to do is kind of work our way in this direction, kind of. Because then we'll come back in and fill in the gap and then it'll basically once we're done with this side we'll work on the middle and it'll start to look really really nice from there all right so we're gonna place a soul sand to write another brick and then take us black glazed terracotta and place it on top of another brick on top of the soul sand we're gonna take us magenta terracotta and place it on top of the soul sand and take us soul sand and place it on top of black glazed terracotta and then place one to left and then one more on top of the left block to left of the soul sand we're going to place us mid, um actually let's take us our purple terracotta here i want to place that to the left of the um soul sand the bottom soul sand row and we're going to take us purple a purpler block and replace that to left of the purple terracotta next thing we're going to do is we're going to place us iron ore to left of the purpler block and then we're going to place us brown terracotta one on top of the iron ore and then two on top of the purpler block so one and two we're going to take us next 
some black glazed terracotta and we're going to place it right in between the brown terracotta and the soul sand and then two on top of the left brown terracotta so we're going to go one two all right So the next thing that we are going to do is when to grab us, let's see, when to grab us a few things here. So when to grab us a note block, a purpler block, um, we'll grab us netherrack, and we're also going to grab us granite. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is place the note block in between the soul sand. Then we're going to place us the granite on top. We're going to place us, oops, I forgot what was one more thing. We need to grab us a purpler pillar too. We need to place us a purpler pillar to the right of the granite. And then we're going to place us a purpler block on top. Then from on top of the black glaze terracotta, we're going to take us to netherrack. And we go one on top. And this is black glaze terracotta to the right. So one on top of it, one on top of the brown terracotta, one on top of black glazed terracotta again. So black glazed terracotta, brown terracotta, black glazed terracotta. And then we're going to go one more up left diagonal. And then we're going to place us a purple pillar underneath it. And then we're going to grab us brown terracotta again and place it underneath the pillar. To left the brown terracotta, we're going to take us note block and place it to the left. Okay. So, um, I think we won't go out anymore with the shoulder from there, and we'll just continue to, um, I guess we'll continue to build up, like how we've been going, because, um, the thing is that some of the sh like the shoulder and the edges, which I had to be really careful with on the other side, it blends into the background. So they, you want just it's difficult around these parts to know exactly how far to go and um, out and build out into it. So it's kind of yeah, it's kind of difficult in some of those areas. All right. So uh, next thing that we are going to do is we're going to take us black glazed terracotta again we want to take us our black terracotta we're going to place black terracotta on top of another brick right here to the left and place black um, black glazed terracotta to the right um, we're going to go down grab us polished andesite and place that to the left of the black terracotta and then we're going to place us two black glazed terracotta, one on top of polished andesite, and then one to the right of it. Then we're going to place one on top of the right black glazed terracotta, and then we're going to take us our soul sand here, place one to the left of the black glazed terracotta, one on top, and then one to the right. On the one to the right, we're going to place us black glazed terracotta on top of it. And then what we're going to do from there is we are going to do place us another black glaze or a black terracotta to left note block. We're gonna go down and grab us another quartz ore, and we're also gonna grab us a bone block. All right, we're gonna place the bone block on top of the note block. Oops. And then we're going to place us another core ore to the left of it. Which, sorry if I'm like, I'm trying my best to do this. I just got to kind of set up stuff a bit differently this time. So I'm trying to do this the best I can. Um, so I'm sorry if it looks weird like the first time. Because it's like, I don't know how to explain this. It's just the way that I'm kind of positioned. Because I'm not using my normal chair that I usually use. That I sit in while doing this. Alright. So, um. Next thing that we are going to do. Let's see. Alright, we are going to. Let's go. First thing I want to do is grab us. We're going to need purple terracotta and blue terracotta. We're going to go back up here. And we're going to take us purple terracotta on top of the nether quartz. Or. Then we're going to go up to on top of the 
bone block with the magenta terracotta and we're gonna go all the way over to the black glazed terracotta then we're gonna place one soul sand to the left of it and then place this black terracotta I mean purple terracotta to the left of the soul sand next thing we're gonna do is place us blue terracotta to the left of the purple terracotta and then place blue terracotta to the left of the black glazed terracotta all right so from there what we're going to do is we're going to take us uh we are going to go inside of the creative inventory and we're going to grab us normal dur dorite and we're going to grab us brown glazed terracotta all right we're going to place the brown glazed terracotta up left diagonal um from the gray concrete right here or on top of another brick right there and then place this door right on top of it then we are going to take a soul sand and place it to the left of the brown glazed terracotta and then place us brown terracotta to the on top of the left um, black glazed terracotta next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab us a uh, spruce wood log from down over here and we'll place spruce wood log on top of the brown terracotta and then we're going to place one to the left of it uh, facing out like this and we're going to place us uh, one more up oops up right diagonal from it so we can just do this or up left diagonal from it and then we want to grab us uh, dark oak wood planks and we're going to place us oops, dark oak wood planks underneath it we're going to go two to the left so we're going to go one two and then one on top of the one facing outwards the next thing that we're going to do from there is we're going to take us brown terracotta and we're going to place it to the left of the one sticking out and then we're going to take us oops soul sand and we're we'll placed to the left of the brown terracotta and then we're gonna take us a note block and place it underneath of the soul sand and then place us brown terracotta to the left of the soul sand and then underneath it which is to the left note block and then one to the left of the top brown terracotta and then from there what we're gonna do is take us another course or and place it underneath the brown or er, place it underneath the note block and then take us a purple terracotta to place to the left of the nether quartz ore all right from here what we're going to do is we're going to place us nether quartz ore right in between the magenta terracotta and the purple terracotta or actually no 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 we're going to take us a purple block and we'll place it in between the magenta terracotta and purple terracotta and then we're going to take us, um, let's see here, we're going to take us some polished granite and place that to the left of the purple terracotta right here. And, and we're going to work on this chunk in the next video. I want to, let's see how much time we got left. Um, all right, right before we end real quick, we are going to take a gray terracotta right here. And on top of the spruce wood log, we're gonna go up three. So we're gonna go one, two, three, and then two on top of soul sand, one, two. Take a nether brick block right here. And on top of the dark oak wood plank, we're gonna go two, one, two, and then one gray terracotta on top. And then we're gonna place this three to the left of the gray terracotta one two three and then one underneath the left or the the far right nether brick block all right and i think that'll be all for this video i want to thank you all for watching i hope you guys have enjoyed um i'm going to try to make another video right after this one uh, I want to thank you all for watching and make sure to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so that way you never miss a Juice World Pixel Art tutorial. Uh, yep, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!